Oh, wait, wait. Oh, God. Ah! Ah! Swerve! I was trying to turn, but I wasn't oh, sure where the turn God. was. Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh. Don't, don't go, like, all the way up. So, today, we're going to the airport to actually see our friend Andrea fly a Cessna plane, and we're going to be in the back seat. So, this will be really fun because this is my first time in a Cessna. Is it yours? Or? Um, I think it's my first time in a Cessna, but growing up here on Maui, I've definitely flown some tiny ass airplanes. But yeah, it's no, yeah, I think this is gonna be my first time in a Cessna as well. And she warned us that it's gonna be really cramped. I mean, I'm not tall, I'm like only 5'7, but I feel like for someone like me and then even for Maggie, it's if it's that small, she's saying it's gonna be cramped. It must be really small. But I was joking yesterday. I was like, well, we're compact people. Like, it should be fine. Yeah, it's, the, it's the nicest way to call me a shorty ever. I am small. Wow, you're so compact. <laughs> yeah, we're both fun size. Oh, so God. No, sure. you're fun size. I'm compact. Wait. Why are you stressing? We're late. You always make us late. Ah! Where are we? Oh my so, gosh. Uh, so, uh, to get to the flight school, you can't go to the airport. You have to take like this back road. And it looks like this. And it looks, yeah. Literally the middle of friggin' nowhere. Yeah, we're in like this safari. Ah! 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 That was me drifting. I did make that sound. That sound was directly from the car, not me. It's cool. Ah! Ah, wait, wait. Oh God. Ah! I was trying to turn, but I wasn't sure where the turn was. Taking a right. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Turn right. Right. There you are. Alright. Hey, how you doing, brother? Nice to meet you. Good. Good to meet you. Yeah. Maggie and Mick? Mick. Mick. Yeah. Maggie and Mick. Mick Jagger. <laughs> So what are we doing today? So today we're gonna go flying in a 738 Foxtrot Alpha. Foxtrot. We're going Jeez. to go on the backside of Molokai to view the sea cliffs and hopefully do some diving down by Ala Wow. Yeah, it should be really fun. Maybe we'll get to see the coral reefs and waterfalls. No, it's gonna be incredible. Yeah, it's gonna be an amazing view. Visibility is really good today, so wow. it should be fun. Wow, are you excited? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> quality is good or if it has any debris it shouldn't but you know that sort of thing but it's all really basic stuff wow yeah so this is just another day in the life as jet setters you know how we do it out here <laughs> oh whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. don't don't go like all the way up just oh, like oh, stand oh. on that one step oh. <laughs> oh, we don't want you to go so this thing has a maximum capacity, 27 gallons. I don't know how far that's gonna take us. small issue with the brakes so we did not fly but it's okay 
So the left brake on the plane was not working at all. So we decided to go the next day instead where it ended up much, much better. Roll the clip. Good morning, beautiful people. Uh, she just said this is part two of the little vlog. Ah, okay. It's like 5.30 a.m. and we're running back over to the airport. Rockets out of the starting blocks! And because we're getting there early, the flight control deck is actually quiet. Instead of having to wait like 20 minutes for the big planes to come and go, the little planes can just all go. So we're gonna get there and boom, we're gonna be flying in the air. So wish us luck and we'll see you at the airport. Sunrise is looking freaking incredible. It's gonna be insane. At the airport early in the morning, there's no big planes moving. No one's flying yet. We have one of the first ones in the air. We get the sunrise all to ourselves. That air traffic control over there isn't even open yet. It's literally dead silent. Except for those birds. Nothing unusual. If there was water or debris, you would see it sinking to the bottom. So we can go to wherever it is that you'd like to this morning. There's Hana, which has a really beautiful small airport. There's Molokai. Um, the backside has the tallest sea cliffs in the world, and I've never done that at 5.30 in the morning, so that might be fun. Um, we'll probably do a landing at Kalapapa. Alternatively, we could go to Lanai, which looks like something out of a National Geographic safari in the morning. You'll see wow. giant herds of deer, all of this light passing over the mountain over there. It's, that's pretty amazing too. Yeah, I'm down for whatever. It'll be really cool no matter what. The right tire is a flat, <laughs> but all, all he's doing is Bring it over to the hangar, we're gonna pump it up full of air, and it'll be perfect and we'll be good to go.
<laughs> All right. That was just the gonna smoothest push landing. Push it off the runway ever. real quick. And that's sick. Not bad at all. <laughs> yeah, I love it. This is an adventure. We're pushing the plane. So the plane, we're pushing off the runway because uh, one of the tires is flat. Here we have Mick and Maggie helping to move this plane off the runway. <laughs> Absolutely wild. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, I thought it was just gonna be like... It's kind of flat, wow. but it's... <laughs> Holy it's <sh> <laughs> Yeah, it, it's not a little flat. It's like super flat. <laughs> on buck shots underneath the plane. What does that even mean? <laughs> what the hell? I'll just text you fast. I mean, you need to get down there on that ramp. The radios just went dead in the middle of the flight. Yeah. Take that via echo. Alaska 862, my Okay, guys, sick little mini plane. Boom, actually healthy snacks. Look at that. Oh, this is living. This is living. They have a vending machine. Look at this. Man, look at this little thing. Sick. Beautiful. Well, camera's about to die, so it was a great day, great morning, and thanks for joining the vlog, guys. We will see you in the next one. Bye. There she is, the odor. <laughs> there she is.